Hi everyone, my name is Svetlana and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing some new products from Garnier and it's a Garnier Green Labs. They came up with three different combinations of serums and gels. The first one is a melon, which is contains a hyaluronic acid. The next one is cannabis sativa with a vitamin B and it's that one is for pore perfecting. And I decided to go with pineapple and vitamin C for brightening i got one of each products and the first one is the face a serum and the other one is a gel wash i'm gonna tell you a little bit about the products and what i like and possibly did not like about this product let's just go ahead and start with the first one and this is the face serum this is actually three in one it's a face cream face serum and it does contain spf of 30. So if your skincare routine is very simple and very minimal and if you don't have a lot of time for example in the morning to apply all of the creams and all of the serums and all of the eye creams and the SPFs and whatever it is so this product could be for you because as I already mentioned it's a serum cream and the SPF 3 in 1. If you're one of those people who skip the SPF and even though it's already full time it's still very important to use SPF and for me personally before I found the right SPF for my skin I didn't use them I didn't believe in them and I just simply did not like the smell of them I didn't like the texture of them how oily and kind of irritating to my skin I have been trying these products for the last four days I know it's not enough time to see a huge difference in skin tone and texture and brightening and whatever it is but I have been using it for four days and I really really enjoy this serum I'm gonna pump some on my hand so you can see the texture and everything else and you actually don't need too much product as you can see it looks like it has a little bit of white cast but as you massage it into your skin it completely disappears and then it gives this very beautiful glow to your skin it's non-greasy but at the same time it's very hydrating it has very mild citrusy scent it doesn't smell like pineapples and i was thinking that it probably gonna smell like pineapples because i really really like that scent it has the citrusy scent but just not the pineapple the main ingredient for this serum is the pineapple and the vitamin c it's all about brightening skin tone and getting rid of that dull and even skin tone and as you already see on my hand when you apply it it does give this beautiful healthy glow to the skin and it feels really really good both of the products come in the recyclable packaging as i already mentioned this is a vegan they do not contain a mineral oils parabens and artificial dyes which really great i really really like the fact that more and more drugstore companies going clean and vegan direction it's super important because not everyone can afford a very high-end products but all of us want to include more of a clean products on our skin and uh, kind of protect our environment as well the serums are a little on the pricier side for $21.99 at Ulta for 2.4 fluid ounces or 72 milliliters so this is not that much product but as you could see you don't need too much product to apply on your face and if you think about it if you have to purchase three different products like face serum face cream and spf it probably will cost you about 30 to 40 dollars for three of them so for 21 dollars, it's not that bad but it is a little on the pricier side let's go ahead and move on to the wash and as i already mentioned this is the same pineapple vitamin c collection and i decided to go specifically with this collection because i do have some dark spots especially after the summertime and i want to even out my skin tone just a little bit more and kind of brighten my skin as well this is a brightening gel wash and they describe it as a gentle scrub free facial cleanser it's supposed to remove all of the makeup excess oil and dirt that you might have at the end of the day it has very liquidy gel like consistency I'm gonna go just a little slower so you can see and then I will open it and then I'll show you how it is 
um, what's the consistency and everything else. It's 4.4 fluid ounces or 130 milliliters for $9.99. So the price for this gel wash is very affordable. It's very comparable to a lot of the drugstore face washes, face makeup removers and stuff like that. You're not supposed to use this product to remove your eye makeup. And this is the first negative thing for me personally, because when I have a makeup remover or face wash or anything like that, I do like to use the same product all over my face so then I don't have to worry if the product got in my eyes or not. I do understand maybe for a lot of you this is not a big deal and I do like to double cleanse or even triple cleanse my my face up personally. It's just inconvenient and in this situation I just have to have more than one product to remove all of the makeup from my face. The other thing that I've noticed personally it doesn't remove all of the makeup completely. I still feel like I have a little bit of makeup here and there. So when the face gels and makeup removers does do not remove all of the makeup after the two or three times when you use it, I tend not to use this product anymore because I just feel like I'm wasting my time. I really like the fact that it is actually a brightening face gel. The skin looks very bright and I do have more of an even skin tone. What I decided to do, instead of using it as a makeup remover because it doesn't really work really well as a makeup remover, I use this product in the morning just as a face cleanser to kind of brighten and get my skin ready for the day. So the combination of using this face gel in the morning and then applying this face serum right after just gives this super beautiful bright very even skin tone the makeup goes on really nice and smoothly uh, before I forget I'm gonna show you the consistency of the product and I just want to make sure that you see it's super runny it's gel-like, but very liquidy gel-like. It's more of our water. And as you can see, it uh, doesn't foam up or anything like that. So maybe this is one of the reasons why it actually doesn't remove the makeup that well. But if I'm using this product in the morning, I do not have any makeup in the morning. It just kind of removes a little bit of excess oil from the night time and that's it. Well, if you massage it long enough, it will foam up just tiny, tiny bit. Not even foaming up. I, I feel like it's just changing the color, but here it is. So I'm gonna go ahead, wash it out, and then I'll show you how my hand looks right after okay so here is my hand right after and as you can see it does give this beautiful glow to the skin and it does it didn't dry it out it didn't do anything overall i did enjoy both of the products even though the gel wash does not really remove the makeup but it's a great cleanser for the morning the face serum i did enjoy quite a bit i really like how soft and hydrated and very glowing my skin is after I apply this face serum, the fact that it's three in one, the serum, cream, and the SPF, it saves me so much time in the morning because I don't have to layer quite a bit of products and kind of wait for them to absorb before I apply my makeup. The makeup goes on super nice and smoothly. So both products have very great quality. I would highly recommend the face serum if you're trying to use the gel wash as a makeup remover. It didn't work really well for me, but it might work for you a lot better. That's all I have to say about these two products. I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.